it's dead. Oh no. What's today? Wednesday. He's been dead a week. I didn't know he was so close. No one did. He didn't tell anyone. You know why? Because of me. Because he... He knew I'm so scared. I'm some sort of carrier. This makes three people I've been with who are dead. I think I loved Albert best of all. And he went so fast. His mother wanted him back in Phoenix before he died. And this was last week when it was obvious, so I get permission from Emma and I bundle them all up and I take them to the plane in an ambulance. Pilot refused to take off. I refused to leave the plane. He would have been proud of me. So finally they get another pilot. But then after we take off, Albert loses his mind, not recognizing me. Not knowing where he was, I thought he was going home. And then right there on the plane, Albert becomes in incontinent. He starts doing it in his pants and all over the seat. Shit, piss, everything. So I yank down the suitcase and I pull out whatever clothes are in there. And I start mopping up as best I can. People all around us are staring at us and moving away in droves. I'm just sitting there holding his hand. Saying, Albert, man, please hold it. For us, for Albert, for Bruce. And when we got to Phoenix, there's a police van waiting for us. And the police who are all wearing complete protective rubber clothing. They look like goddamn astronauts. And by the time... By the time we got to the hospital where his mom had fixed up the room real nice... Robert was gone. You and Felix mind if I spent the night on your sofa? Just one night. I don't want to go home. <laughs>